Hello friends, welcome to my channel. This is Charan. In this video, I will show you in MVC how to join multiple tables into a single HTML table using view data. And here we got the final output joining multiple tables, the country names from the country table, state names from the state table and the city names from the city table. That's it. If you are a first time visitor to my channel, please subscribe to get the latest updates. Before writing the coding part in MVC, first we'll check the tables and the column names I want to join. The tables I'm using, the country table which contains two columns, CID and C name. The second table is a state which contains three columns. SID is a state ID, state name and CID which is a country ID. When we want to join tables, at least one column name must be same in two tables. If you notice here in the state table, the last column is a CID which is a country ID. If you notice in the country table, the CID is a country ID. So both the column names are same, the country table and state table. And the last table I want to join the city table which contains city ID, city name and SID. The last column in the city table SID is both are same in the state table SID. Now my aim is I want to join these three tables into a single table to display the country name, state name and city name. For this video tutorial I am creating a new MVC application. Go to file, new, project. I am selecting ASP.NET web application in the .NET framework I am using 4.6.1. The application name is MVC tables join view data. Click OK. And from the templates I am selecting MVC. Click OK. And the MVC application is created successfully. Let's close this default window. Open Solution Explorer. Now in this application I am adding ADO.NET Entity Model. I click the project name. Add adword.net entity data model I'm selecting that one the model name is joint tables okay and from the model contents I'm selecting the first option next I'm creating a new connection the server name is After adding server name, I am selecting the database name, sample db, test connection, is succeeded, ok, ok. And here we got the connection string and the connection string name is a sample db entries and I am saving this connection string in the web.config file. Click next. And from the selected database objects, I am expanding the tables as well as DBO. The tables which is a city, country and the last one is a state table. Here it is. So I have selected three tables. Finish. And here we got the entity models of the three tables, country, state and city. After adding the data models, next in the solution explorer, let's minimize this references folder. I'm adding a class in this models folder. Right click the models, add class. The class name is multiple tables join add. Now in this class, I am adding the public properties, public, I am adding the table names, the table name first one is a country, the property name is a country list, get set. And second property is a public state, state list, get set. And the last one is a city, public city city list 
get set. So after adding the properties in the class, next let's create a controller in this controllers folder. Right click the controllers, add controller. And I'm selecting MVC for controller empty, add. The controller name is tables join view data. Add. And here we got the controller also. Now the first thing in this controller, I'm adding the model namespace using the project name is mvc tables join view data dot i'm adding models folder after that in the action result index i'm adding the connection string sample db entities sd is the object name new sample db entities after that list class i'm adding country table the object name is the country list is equals to sd dot countries dot to list method. Let's copy this one. The second list is the state. The object name is the state list sd dot states dot to list the last one is a city the table name the object name is a city list sd dot cities dot to list now I am implementing the joining the tables using view data so view data between double quotes join tables is a view data name is equals to from C in country list join join ST in state list on C dot C ID equals st dot cid into table 1 from st state object in table 1 dot default if empty now I'm joining the city table and the state table join city is a city table object in city list on st dot sid equals city dot sid the condition here i'm joining the city table and the state table with the help of the sid column into i'm creating an alias table name dummy table from ct in table to table two dot default if empty select new i'm adding the class name multiple join class to get the properties multiple table join class now between these curly braces i am adding c country list is equals to c comma state list is equals to st city list is equals to c sorry it's a ct because a city list object is a ct now in the return view I'm adding this view data join tables. Copy this one and paste here. That's it. We have done the coding part to join multiple tables, country, state, and city. Now we need the index view page. So before adding the view page to this project, we must build the application first. Build project build solution. And here we got the output message, the build succeeded.
let's close this output message box highlight the index action result right click that one add view the view name is index only and the template I'm not selecting any template I'm leaving empty without model add and here we got the index view page the first thing in this index view page I'm deleting the header tag h2 I'm adding center tag h1 MVC how to join multiple tables three tables display using view data horizontal line now after the horizontal line now after the horizontal line I'm adding a table element table border one now in this table I'm adding tr the first tr for the table headers th the first table header the column name is a uh, country names th second header is the state names th the last one is the city names after adding the table headers the next one the next one I want to bind the data from the three tables so for that I'm using for each loop here add for each loop variable item in I'm adding view data join tables as I enumerable in this I enumerable I'm adding the multiple join class the model namespace copy this one dot the class name is a multiple table join class now let's bind the data tr td is a row at item dot first one is a country list dot c name td at item dot state list dot s name state name td at item dot city list dot city name that's it we have done the complete coding part but before run this application the most important we need to change the controller name in the road config file open solution explorer app underscore start expand that one road config.cs open that one file and notice here the controller name is a home just delete that one our controller name is tables join view data I'm adding that one and the action result is the index page only which is this one that's it let's check the results Google Chrome and here we got the final output joining multiple tables the country names from the country table state names from the state table and the city names from the city table that's it